Good morning, everyone. Hope you're doing okay on this snowy Friday morning. I just wanted to take a few minutes and share a few things with you uh, going into the weekend. Um, but before I do that, I wanted to introduce you to my friend Harbaugh here. He has been with us for about two and a half, three years now, and just hangs out in the basement um, and just a place of comfort. So, uh, say hello. All right, all right, now to the serious stuff. Um, you have received an email if you are one of our HOTC families uh, that has shared the news that the leagues at the earliest would begin May 15th. Um, so since we don't know whether or not we'll be on the field or in college classrooms, campuses, site visits, you name it, uh, part of the city staff want to still become relevant and supportive for you during this time. So you should have received an email that has a survey and asking questions, what are the pressing needs that you have right now? And how can Heart of the City support you during this time? It is super, super important for everybody to fill that out and get it back to us. The sooner that we have that information, the better informed we'll be to make the decisions to support you. So if it's internet, if it's food, if it's unemployment, if it is transportation, if it is medical supplies at home, whatever it is, please let us know because we are talking to our partners here in the community and looking for ways to be supportive. We recognize that soccer is the first portion of our organization and then secondarily it's the post-secondary education. But since we're in this crisis time period, we still want to be able to support you. So please, please, please let us know what we can do to help you during this time. So with that, I, Scott McClellan, and my buddy Harbaugh here, wish you all a prosperous, well, I don't know if I even use the word prosperous, but a very uh, peaceful, tranquil weekend. I believe it's supposed to be in the 50s, which is a lot nicer than what's happening today. Um, so with that, have a good weekend.